Hi, I am Valder Beebe. I am the host and the visionary of That Celebrity Interview. Dr. Wyckoff, thank you so much for joining me live in Dallas, Texas on the Valder Beatty Show. How are you today? Thanks. What a privilege to be here with you. I'm doing fine. Thank you. I'm so excited to talk with you because we're going to talk about vision. It's one of the most important things in our ability to uh, survive as human beings. So you're here with some eye-opening news because I heard or I read that 42 million Americans age 40 and older, are visually impaired. I thought that was startling statistics, doctor. Yeah, the numbers really are startling. I absolutely agree, Valder. You know, there's two major diseases it's important that viewers and listeners recognize. So wet age-related macular degeneration, or AMD, causes actually more blindness, not a word I use lightly, across our society than everything else combined. And then DME, or diabetic macular edema, causes the most amount of blindness among working age populations, people like you and me, with nearly three quarters of a million people diagnosed newly each year with DME. And both of these diseases are very manageable and treatable, especially when caught early. So what are some of the symptoms to catch it uh, or that we can share with our doctor so he can start to look for it? Yeah, absolutely. First and foremost, I want people to recognize that, in fact, most people start both of these diseases completely asymptomatic, meaning people can think that they're doing just fine, even when they harbor significant eye disease inside their eye. So because of that, everybody with diabetes, at least once a year, needs to have a comprehensive dilated eye exam. And then everybody over the age of about 60 should have regular eye exams also. Now, if someone does develop symptoms, what are they going to experience? The most common symptoms are blurriness, blind spots, straight lines looking wavy, faded or dull colors, and flashes or floaters. So really, if you notice anything that's unusual, don't assume it's your glasses. Get a comprehensive dilated eye exam and see what's going on in the back of your eye. Why do we always talk about, and I know you're not an endocrinologist, but why do we always talk about diabetes and eye problems? Yeah, there really is a strong link there worth considering. So diabetes is common. About 50% of Americans either have frank diabetes or have substantial risk of developing diabetes. And once someone has diabetes, there's a very high probability over 5 to 15 years that they are going to develop manifestations in the back of their eye. So the back of the eye, the retina, is really sort of the canary in the coal mine or the tip of the iceberg, if you will, one of the earliest places that diabetes can manifest um, across the body. So it's really important to get a dilated eye exam regularly at least once a year if you're diabetic. And I'd like to say, as a doctor, I'm sure you're saying you must treat diabetes, you would do, must do all the things which I know are eating right, exercising, taking your medication in order to either keep it in control or to stave it off. Yeah, great point. Two things I would mention there are right in line with what you're saying. First of all, optimize your cardiovascular risk factors, blood sugar, blood pressure, cholesterol. It's not just enough to feel okay. You've got to make sure your numbers are good with your physician. And then from an eye care specific perspective, there are really good treatment options now that didn't exist in the recent past that can help improve vision and prevent vision loss. So make sure you're getting the eye care that you need. Dr. Wyckoff, if my audience needs to find out more information or if they, they have uh, uh, symptoms and they're not sure what they are, what's their next step? Yeah. First of all, I would say establish a relationship, a long-term relationship, with a local eye care professional. There's great professionals in every city across our country. Make sure they're doing a dilated, comprehensive eye exam. If you're interested in finding out, there's a lot of good resources online also. One website in particular is looktoyourfuture.com. Dr. Wyckoff is a board-certified retina surgeon and ophthalmologist with Retina Consultants of Houston. Dr. Wyckoff, thank you so very much for this important information. I talk about diabetes all the time. Not the only thing, but I talk about that quite a bit. So thanks for being my guest. 
Valder, what a privilege. Thank you for having me.